Hi everybody. Uh, today I show you the result of my latest project. It's uh, yeah, a development environment for the Directrix. I'm sure if you be here on that page, you know already what Directrix is. Um, the only thing you have to go for the moment is going to that URL. I will also post it to the comments below. But actually, it's kind of GitHub, Roger Bosch, Vectrex Dev. And then go to the download. Unzip it. Open it. And that's all you have to do to install the environment. The tool itself consists of an editor, of an emulator, and of course of a compiler in the background. So when you first go to check your, the code, which is on the left side, then you see the compiler is not installed. That's because I use uh, a CMOC, that's a special compiler for the, the Vectrex platform, not only for the Vectrex, but also for the Vectrex. Um, and therefore we have to first to install the compiler, but don't worry. Uh, it's already integrated in the app, so you don't have to take care on the command line, on building the library and stuff like that. It uh, downloads all the necessary things from GitHub, install it, and after that you can directly use. So it's really simple like that. Now we are ready to write our first code. In this tutorial, it's more about the tool and to show you how it works and how the installation is going on. So I will not write uh, any code now, but uh, I've prepared an example here. We can run that. And it's a very simple example. We draw a box into the screen and we can move with the joystick. It's really simple like that. And when you look on the left side uh, at the code a little bit, with uh, the help of syntax highlighting, it's even easier to learn the vector X because we have uh, some helping functions which are integrated in the uh, library I adapted for that tool. Then we have the standard BIOS call, so that's the call back to the uh, functionality and BIOS routines of the vector itself. And of course the rest is C standard coded. So it's really, really easy to port normal C programs like that to the Vectrex. Um, in this part of the tutorial, I don't go into programming, but no worry. I plan to do a really comprehensive tutorial in writing a game in C code for the Vectrex. And I hopefully have it ready the first part uh, next weekend. We will start with a simple Hello World and bring that up to a hopefully nice game at the end. So I hope you download the tool, you like it, and yeah, give me some feedback, what you think about, what you miss, what you would like to see more. And keep in mind, it's not about really professional developer, because uh, for that you need probably more functionality, uh, assembler integration, stuff like that. You can do a lot already with uh, Classic Scoda for Rectrex, but the main purpose is actually to really support the beginner and the learner uh, to bring closer to the Vectrex development. So I hope you like and yeah, see you soon.